Hi, this is Bill from VacLab, and today we're going to do a live test of a Kirby Centria 2 on my airflow box. We're going to measure with the GM8901 anemometer. Now, the test conditions are I have a brand new clean cloth HEPA bag in the machine, unused. Our test voltage is 122 volts rounded up. And that's from a 20 amp circuit. And you can see the machine has already been mounted on the airflow box. So we're adjust here with our high tech shims, which is cardboard. And as you can see, in order to get accurate readings, there's a small air gap there, and the same way on the other side. And even though it's very difficult or impossible to see, there's going to be a very small air oh. gap here. After all, it's a cardboard box. So we'll use these very high-tech microfiber claws to block up the front, and these green ones here for the sides. So I'm going to pause the camera while I go and get the microfiber claws all set up. Okay, we got 5177 feet per minute times my conversion factor, and we're looking at 135 CFM, just slightly over. What's funny about the whole thing is anything over 5,000 feet per minute or 130 CFM, and this actually can stick to this hole and I don't have to hold it up. <laughs> it's kind of funny. All right, so there you go. You've got your first live airflow box test with the Kirby Centria 2, and we topped out at about 135 CFM with the brush roll spinning and a clean HEPA bag installed. See you later.